40 years ago, we built a new hospital here on what was empty land. Now we're able to put essentially a new hospital in this expansion in the Bolivar community. I mean, it's just an exciting time uh, for CMH and for the Bolivar community. It's an expansion that's pretty significant. So 137,000 square feet expansion uh, to our existing facility. It'll actually be uh, on the south side of our current hospital. It'll be built um, approximately where the current cafeteria is. And it's um, 23,000 square feet then of renovation. We're excited to partner with the USDA uh, and the project and really to essentially put a brand new hospital uh, in the Bolivar community. After the new construction's finished, what we'll do is we'll go back and we already have the start of a plan to change use of the existing hospital space. So uh, current hospital will be for support services um, to the hospital. Um, some of it will be office space. Um, uh, other places might be other services that would support the inpatient needs. We're in the design development phase of the project. So um, our first level of design is called schematic design, where we're looking at the overall big picture of what services we're going to have in the new space. Lately and for the last couple of months, we've been in design development, which then gets into the details of each room, even so much as you're looking at uh, where the um, sharps containers are going to be, uh, how the head wall is going to be laid out, uh, things like that. So we've been actually working with a lot of our frontline staff and leaders and physicians to look at um, the details of the rooms and make sure they have what they need to be able to provide care. Um, so we're actually toward the end of design development and um, we actually need to get a construction manager on board, which we're in the process of doing, to help us close out design development to get us into construction documents. Then when they're complete, we'll be able to break ground on the project. Uh, we hope to break ground in the fall of this year. So um, September, October, November of 2023. So it's something that we can really rally around, get excited about and know that um, this will probably take us into the next 40 years and all of the rooms are gonna be private rooms, appropriately sized, state-of-the-art technology. It's exciting for our staff, exciting for our patients, exciting for our community, and I think it'll help us to grow as we continue to expand the service we provide. There's room in this building for us to grow our services, and I think that'll happen partly because we just provide excellent care here at CMH, and then also because the facilities will be up to date with the current standards, so we're really excited about it.